Friday, August 25th. And it is 1041. You know the drill for today. But today is a more intense day because I'm doing high yoga and Pilates, which is the same thing because it's all in the same studio. But high, the high yoga and Pilates studio, the Pilates is like, it don't have as much tools compared to an actual Pilates studio. And then I got, I'm trying Soul Cycle for the first time. Yeah, because I did Rebel Ride and then I went over to Cycle Bar. So I'm trying Soul Cycle. I'm so I'm trying Soul Cycle for the first time today. And then I have a, I think a six or seven o'clock Pilates, Pilates, Pilates class. So yeah, I'm excited for all of that. I'm looking forward to it. I try to like twist my hair out today, but it just knotted up like those big, like, it knotted up like those big clusters. Not clusters, but those locks. Going for that. No. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Yeah, so it wasn't given. Uh, do my hair look uneven? Yeah, because this side is more flared out than this side. If I could just twist it, but. Anyway, I'm gonna continue to get ready and then I'm gonna show y'all my outfit. See the difference that moisturizer makes? <sighs> um, do you remember when I posted that photo of myself I'm in the pissed. wheelchair? Like and you're like, ow, oh, that doesn't even look like you. Um, yeah, because I just fainted. You Dude, stop. Is free or so you're gonna day. come and judge me? You free don't piss me off, you you fucking today. Hypocrite. Okay. You're so dumb. Okay, See what I mean? Little... Like, just get. I don't know. I think that is. Fine. Okay, anyway. I have. Okay, I feel like that looks way better. Honestly, I really don't know because now I'm about to start getting frustrated. Anyway, it's... Today is launch day. Today is August 25th. The site opens at 12 p.m. It will be linked down below. And I'm excited about today. I got a really good feeling. So yeah, let's get the day started. So you know I've been telling y'all I've been wanting to go to Marshalls so I could get some like new workout gear. So y'all, I actually did it this time. I went to Marshalls and I got me some a few things. The f what? Okay. I think I look good now. I'm not about to trip because I, I said to myself, I want to feel pretty again. I want to feel good today. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm trying to decide with glasses I'm going to wear. These are like my classic black, but these make my face look crooked. These are crooked, actually. So I'm going to wear these. And I'm bringing my toiletry bag. So, you're. I think I should bring my iPad too. Let's drop that so that I may need that. need to be making my way downstairs because I need to make my my food 
I was gonna make myself a breakfast, but then it was already 11 o'clock. Girl, I don't know, honey. It's a little too late for that. Not really, but like the class started at 12. So I don't wanna be late. It was only like 33 minutes to get there, but I don't wanna be late. Okay, so I'm here at the Paris Baguette now because I missed my class today. I missed my 12 o'clock class. I was halfway, like, from the place at 12 o'clock when it started, and I got down here at 12.45, so I was like, the class is ending now. So I missed my 12 o'clock class. I tried to see if they could put me on for a later class, but I checked the schedule and they didn't, they didn't have a, a early late class. They only had a 4.30. But I have spent at 4.30. Well, four o'clock rather. So I'm gonna do my usual. I'm gonna sit in here until it's time for me to leave. Probably find something to eat. Well, I have something to eat. I had to throw my sandwich away. I had to throw my sandwich away, y'all. I had to throw my sandwich away. So I was walking down the street to get to my bus, and um, I was walking down the street to get to my bus, and this guy, his daughter, I seen it before it all happened, but his daughter was coming from behind me. We I guess they were going to the car, and she was closing the gate, but the little dog that they had was going, was was trying to get through the gate and he did so he gets to the bottom of the stairs and now he's following behind me and the guy is like get him get him get him and i'm thinking it's like he's, he's saying like uh bring him to me bring him to me i'm thinking he's talking to the dog i'm thinking that's like a little cold where he got with the dog so i'm looking at the dog to see if the dog's gonna respond girl he's talking to me he's talking to me and i had my sandwich in my hand i had a sandwich i had just made before i left the house for breakfast I had that in my hand, and I had to throw my sandwich in the recycling bin, the nearest recycling bin I could find so I could pick this dog up, because I'm like, I'm not gonna get my sandwich to him, and I'm not gonna put my sandwich on the floor. Y'all, I had to throw my sandwich in the trash, and when I was on the bus on my way to coming into the city, I just kept thinking about like, I really just threw my sandwich in the trash. Like, I just made that, and I had to throw it in the trash. Not even the trash, but the recycling bin. That was frustrating. That was really frustrating, but it's okay, because I got another sandwich, so I ain't tripping, but, like, I just, like, damn, of course you caught me at this current moment, but, um, I'm here in the Paris Baguette, again, this is, like, the only cafe I really like around here, there's really no other cafes that you could really sit in and chill in, other than this one, and, um, we got a watermelon cucumber refresher, I think I'm gonna try it, not today, though. Today is launch day, y'all. Today is launch day. I'm really excited. But um, I'm gonna sit here until it's time for me to get to my spin class. And I'm gonna eat my sandwich. I need to wash my hands, for real. And once I do that, I'm gonna eat. Cause I'm not hungry, but I ain't eat all my sandwich. I literally had just made that sandwich. I had put cottage cheese on it and everything. And I had to throw it in the trash. But it's all good. I feel like that was like God needed me to do that. I don't know. But yeah, today is going to be a good day. And um, I don't know what happened to my hair or if anything did happen to it. I think I might just go low again. I think I really just might. I think I might go low cut again. I'm thinking about it. For real. <laughs> I'm going to be real vulnerable with y'all right now. I feel very self-conscious about my shorts. They're really, 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 really short. But I put like a pair of like uh, compression shorts under them. But the shorts are so short and my shirt is kind of long. So it hides the shorts. And I feel like people are like staring at me. <laughs> but I know it's probably nobody staring at me because there's other people out here with just as short as shorts me but I just wanted to say that oh but y'all let me show y'all my sandwich okay so
My mom knows that I'm trying to abolish Hold So my mom is aware that I am trying to abolish, what is it, lunch meat and cheese. Well, not cheese, but it's lunch meat. Because lunch meat goes so fast nowadays. Like, and my grandma was like, maybe it's already molding in the store. Maybe it's already going expired in the store. Obviously, it probably is. Because why two days after we get it, you know, it's all slimy. But I've been telling my mom, don't get lunch meat. Get, rotis get rotisserie chickens. You can shred the chicken, cut it up how you want it. You know, it's not as thin or as, like, you know, platable as lunch meat. But, you know, you can still work with it. It's just as good. It's maybe ten times better and more versatile. But, um, I did that. So, I, I got, and then, I don't know if I told y'all, but I, I started using Too Good To Go. I thought about it one night. And I decided to uh, book an order with them. And I got this <laughs> for wheat bread. And then she gave me like some malt candies. And I was like, ooh, they played in my face with this. I thought I was getting so much more. But when I got home and I really started like looking back, I'm like, no, I got more than enough. Because they gave me this big round roll of wheat bread. I wish I caught the name of it. But they had the name at the bottom. But the way it was in the bag, I couldn't get it out. So I had to put it in a different bag and cut it up. Well, we got a breath. Anyway, girl. Um, so what I did was I, I cut up the wheat bread. I used this spicy, this sweet, spicy mustard as the base. And then I layered the cheese on. Put it in an air fryer for two minutes at 350. Boom. Then take it out. Shred the chicken. Put the chicken on top. What else I put on top of the chicken? Put the chicken on top. Avocado. And then on your other slice of bread. You get Chick-fil-A sauce. So good. It's so freaking good. That looks so cute. Y'all, I'm trying to like hide from the owner of the store because I be coming in here and I be eating my own food and I just be sitting here for hours. And, but it don't say nowhere you can't solicitate. But I know that solicitating is sitting somewhere and not buying nothing. And I be coming in here all the time. They always see me in here, but I be buying stuff. I'm a, I'm a customer. I'm a customer, but um, what if they say this is like petty, petty robbery, petty thief, petty thief? I don't know. I'm not trying to buy nothing today. I missed my class today this morning. I was so upset. I love yoga. I love going to my yoga class, and I missed it today. That, that kind of upset me for real. I ain't gonna lie, but it's all good. It's all good. Um, I got two other classes. I got spin at four o'clock, and then I got a Pilates class at like seven. I think kind of like being out on the town at night is kind of cool, you know. I don't have like a whole lot. Of, I don't stay out in this part of the town a whole lot, but I come down here. I visit a lot, but I'm not like outside of it a lot. So it's kind of nice to experience it at night. I don't know. I'm just excited. Like, I be in a house majority of the week, so I'm excited to be outside and, like, seeing something new. That's all. All right, y'all. So, it is currently 2.40, and um, the tiredness is starting to set in. I'm starting to get really tired, and, um... But for the most part, everything is going pretty well. I try to go and see I, recently over the weekend. No, over the week. I went to go pick up some food and I rode my bike. I decided to use my bike and I lost the sleeve to my AirPods. So I try to go in and see if I could get a new one. And um, that was like, all right, that'll be $69. I'm like, no 
not that it's $69, but no, because that's not what I came in here for today. I wasn't coming in here to spend $69 today. I didn't think I would have to spend anything because I had Apple Care. But they was like, we only covered like damages and stuff like that, not any rep and not any lost like items. And then when I watched him pull it up on his like intercom, he had like a whole itemized like thing of all the individual parts and stuff. And I thought that was so cool. I'm just like, oh, okay, cute. This is cute. But um, yeah, I want to see if I could do that. I missed my 12 o'clock class, but I got a four o'clock class coming up. I gotta pee so bad. I tried to go over to the library, but it went um, I don't think they opened while well, they was closed for a little bit. But I wanted to go, I was gonna go over there and try to read my book. But I don't know, I'm starting to get really, really tired. And I'm getting, I'm sticky. My face feels sticky. It's not a good feeling. But I was on my way into Red House to get to the, um, from where I was coming from. And some guy, he was like, you are gorgeous. And I was like, oh my God. But I recognized this guy. So I thought he was about to say, oh my God, you look so familiar. And I was about to get ready to respond to that. But no, he said, you look so gorgeous. You are gorgeous. That's what he said to me. And we just kept going. I was like, that was like so abrupt. It like really caught me off guard. Not really. I was not on, I wasn't on guard, but it definitely caught me like, oh wow. I don't know if I've ever had somebody publicly compliment me like that. So, so something like that. That was like, I guess like maybe he seen my energy or felt my energy and was like, oh, he needs a little pickup today. Cause I needed that, you know? And that was, that was really nice of him. Cause a lot of days I don't be feeling like I look as, look as good as I think I should. And he was like, you look gorgeous. And then I looked at my kid's self in the camera. I was like, you look gorgeous. Like he was not lying. I needed that reminder. That was a nice pick me up. I needed that. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna wait until like four. And then I'm gonna head on to my class. I need to actually be there 15 minutes ahead of time. So around like four, 345, 45, 40, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. Like maybe like 35 so like 335 i need to be getting here i'm i hope i'm going to a different spin class today so i hope this is a nice uh a nice building i've seen it before but i'm going to it today because the one the the spin that i always go to the reason why i didn't go there today is because my instructor is not in today and her last day is coming up it's like the eighth of one of these months I think like the 8th of September, she's no longer going to be at Cycle, uh, Cycle uh, Bar, Center City. I'm just like, oh, no, I can't have that. I won't be coming then. But the staff is so nice. But now I'm noticing the staff is changing, too. So maybe because they all going back to school or they all going back to their, like, regular, like, you know, in-season jobs rather than, like, their summer jobs. So that could be it. But I'm not sure. Um, but, yeah, I'm trying this Soul Cycle today. And I'm hoping that it's good. I'm hoping that it's cute. Um, and then I got Pilates at seven, so I'm excited. y'all all right so i'm finished with the spin and as i was saying to y'all before like i felt really tired like the tiredness was starting to kick in um what? i know that that seemed that looked like a lot of fun never mind Anyway, um, I'm on my way to the next class that I booked in Northern Liberties, an hour away from where I currently am. And I tried to go to this one before, but I never went because it was too far from where I was going. I was trying to get a different class, but 
now I'm realizing that this ain't what I was really trying to do either. So, but I, it's an hour walk. I'm 36 minutes away now. So, I am I should be there shortly. But I didn't mean to come all the way this way to get to this class. But it's all good. Okay. But, yeah, I'll see y'all when we get there. What was I talking about? Okay, so... I'm going back into like, back into the part to where I go to yoga at, cause this is looking familiar. This is like second and market, closest to second and market. I used to work at Pan's Landing for the Summerfest with Miss Tori at the uh, ice cream spot. But um, I'm about halfway there. Today has been really good. Like I kind of been up and down. I was really self-conscious about my outfit being as though my shirts were so short. And then like the guy, when I was walking to Brit, when I was walking through Brit House, the guy was like, "You are gorgeous," and I guess and that really en enlightened my mood, cause I was kind of feeling really self conscious about myself. I wasn't kind of, I was feeling, and I guess like God was like, "Oh, you need this little boost. You need this like this. You need this," and I and I appreciate him for this, for that. Oh my God, I'm all over the place. Anyway, I'm excited. I'm halfway there. This is my last class of the day, and, um, yeah, I'm, like, in the outskirts now. This is, like, crazy looking. It's trash, but it's, like, the parking lot still at the same time. But I had to take a moment for myself, and I looked at myself in my mirror. I was like, it's gorgeous. Like, you is gorgeous. Although you may not look your best, so you may not think your outfit is as fab as you would like it to be used to. That don't take away from your your beauty you're gorgeous and i had to remind myself like damn like maybe i really did need him to say that because i wasn't feeling super gorgeous but he was like you're gorgeous and i was like you're gorgeous but yeah um i'm all this walking girl they said an hour i was like mm, easy i'm on cobblestone now but i'm halfway there so again we'll we'll meet again when we get there why did i say it like that i don't know i'm rambling now i'm oh wait i know this part they got a little they got a water not a water but they got like a little i remember me and kira used to take us to this spot down here who was it? i think it was kira or evan had introduced it to us all but it's this spot on the water down here in north philly by the Parks Casino, it's right down the street. If I'm do, if I'm going the correct way, I think I'm really close to it, actually. Maybe I go sit by here, but my class start at seven, and um, I don't really want to be out here all that late. So I need to like hurry up and try to find my bus. I would have to walk back into the city because I'm only taking one bus. So this is the outfit. This is what I'm wearing. Um, I originally didn't come out with a white beater on. Look at the forehead, y'all. The sweat. I didn't originally come out here with a white beater. But I put this on because I had got hot after my class. I'm like, let me spice it up. Let me change it up. And that's what I did. So my class starts at 6.30. And I had all this trouble trying to get in the door just to find out they only open 10 minutes before your class. So that was fun, but I'm here now and again, they don't typically let you record, but I'll try to get some footage if I can. I can, y'all can get on the grill. Yo, why I thought the tampons was candies? Yeah, no, they tampons. I thought these were candies, they were good.
props. I need to figure out how I'm about to get home, what bus I need to take, because I'm in the North Philly. I need <laughs> where I need to get on. But um, it is currently 7.32, and I will see y'all when I get home, because I need all hands on deck, and I need to be focused. So I'll see y'all. I look so cute, though. It is currently... Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hey y'all, how y'all doing? It's 915, August 25th, and um, I just got finished cleaning my room. My cat does not respect my boundaries whatsoever. At first I was like, ooh, who's already downstairs? Okay, so at first I was like, ooh, these shorts is really revealing. But as the day went on, I definitely still felt like that. For sure, it's best. I, it was more after I had took my, uh, my my shower. After I took my shower after my spin class, I just like washed down real quickly and like washed my face and then reapply my sunscreen and moisturizer. Cause you know, you gotta do that. Black people need to wear sunscreen. But after I did that, I was like, ooh, life is worth living again. I, was, I wasn't I was sticky, I felt fresh and clean. I was feeling it. I was, I was, I was grooving, I was jigging, I was moving. Because that stickiness and that tiredness, it just, it depletes your social battery. I was just, I was, I, I had a lot of thoughts, a lot of commotion. Oh, look, we could do puppets. It was just, it was a lot. It was a lot of feelings today. And um, I wasn't really feeling that good about myself. But I remember saying in the bed that same morning, like, no, I'm going to, I'm going to get up and I'm going to look good today. I'm going to look cute. I'm getting back to myself today. And... Don't you know, them, your head will do a doozy on you. It will run you loose. But um, although I did feel a lot of emotions, although I was kind of over the place and I was kind of, I was, I was really, really self-conscious. I was severe, I was very self-conscious today. That's what it was. I felt very self-conscious. I felt very exposed, being as though my shorts were so short. And um, it didn't put me in a comfortable spot. But as the day went on, I just stopped caring. It just was like, it just it just melted away. So that's good. And now I'm looking at my, uh, I was looking at it in the mirror at Pilates. Like, oh, this is a really cute outfit, actually. So, um, yeah. I never really showed this much skin on camera. So this is really new for me. Um, but... I'm home, my mom made dinner. She made salmon, which is my favorite food. But like I was telling y'all this morning, I made myself this bomb ass sandwich. So I'm about to make two sandwiches so I can get my bread out the way. And... Turn the real nigga up. Six. I don't dance while I How we used to do it, um... I don't know. Anyway. I'm about to go eat. My shoulders are on ache. Like they hurt so bad. That the instructor was us. That was the last class of the day. I had three classes I did today. Well, I missed my yoga. But I had three classes I went to today. And she was like, use your shoulders. Like basically telling us to move the rest of our body with our shoulders. She was making us do crutches. She made us do side crutches. Oh, it was a lot, girl. It was a lot. Pilates is intense. If y'all don't know, I'm telling you now, Pilates is intense. Some days it might be less intense than others, but some days. It's, it's the truth. It just, that's what it is. And um, my legs, they kind of feel like really, really like not sore, but they feel slightly sore. Anyway, I'm ready to eat and wash my hands. They feel clammy. Okay, my vlog camera is now checking out on me. It wasn't doing this before, but that's how I know. It's a breakthrough coming. Amen. We might go skating tomorrow. This would be really cute, actually. Real friend, real cute, real lenient. Bye, y'all. I'm leaving. Goodbye. <laughs> I just be, like, doing too much. But And I'm like, whoa, this is a lot of familiar faces. And sometimes when I see it, I'm like, oh my God, like, like I know you from afar, but I really don't know you. But it's just like, I follow your TikTok. I'm one of your followers. Ew. 
take rightfully so so to see you in real life is like kind of meta not really necessarily meta but it's like oh this is exciting like they're an actual person that's kind of what it's like to the oh oh okay um today is saturday and there is not much happening today at all but i still have to check in because this is a weekend vlog so if anything does happen today you'll see it but if, it, if nothing happens today then nothing happens today it's a really nice day out but my legs everything i don't even know how to describe it but that was a workout that was a workout but yeah maybe sunday is more eventful i'm not sure yet so today is sunday we didn't do anything on saturday i've been sleeping away i've been sleeping my life away with my but it is today is my phone is on a charger it's 5 5 p.m eastern standard time in philadelphia august 27th sunday but, um Aaliyah uploaded today Aaliyah's face kyra uploaded yesterday i think and then emergency intercom uploaded on Friday. So I got a lot of content to get into. Although I finished Kyrie's video, but I'm about to get into Aaliyah's video. Oh, and Tariq Ali, I think it is, if y'all follow him too. I've been getting back into his content too. So I'm excited, but I'm going to journal and set my intentions for the September month. Apparently, September 1st, nobody's working anymore because all like my classes that I typically go to on every Friday, like nobody's. And nobody's like working that day. Oh, and I went to cycle, I went to Soul Cycle inside a cycle bar this past Friday. He was bald too. His name is Brian. Okay. But he was handsome. He was handsome. Nice skinny guy. I ripped, cause you know, like skinnier guys rip a little more easier, easier than like a more like heavier set guy, because they're they're naturally they don't have a whole lot of weight. So like they just form, I would say, I don't know. I didn't really have to discuss that with y'all. I didn't really have to go into that because I don't know what I'm talking about. But I'm about to shower and I'm excited. I'm excited. Cause I ain't got nothing to do today. So I'm gonna start editing this video. So it's up by Tuesday. That's my deadline for every video that I film is that it be up by Tuesday. A per, per, partially, probably, I may be starting school this Monday. Let that sink in. Oh. <laughs> Y'all, you see what I'm talking about? Like, that's crazy, right? Entry. All right, I'm all. Okay. August 27, 2023. Damn, we're really about to be in September. That's the end of today's video, y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one.